In today's Manoa Memo, I want to talk about the value of collaboration. We have five core values shaped by the acrostic grace, gospel, rest, ambition, C is for collaboration. And what we mean by that, we say it this way at Manoa Community Church, that we partner with Christians across denominational lines to see our region saturated with the gospel. Now, we believe this is a critical value. This is an important value, and we believe it's an extremely biblical value. Well, how do we make this case? Well, right now we're in the gospel according to John. And in John chapters 14 through 16, culminating in the high priestly prayer that Jesus prays chapter 17, one of the key themes in this whole section of scripture is how God is Father, Son, and Holy Spirit are each distinct and yet one, and how they mutually indwell one another. For example, Jesus says in chapter 14, when the disciples say, show us the Father, he says, if you've seen me, You've seen the Father, because I dwell in the Father, and the Father dwells in me. And then he says he goes back to the Father to send the Holy Spirit, so that the Father and Son can make their home in us through the Spirit, distinct and yet one. Well, where this culminates in chapter 17, Jesus actually prays for you, and he prays for me, and he prays for the church not only in the ancient times, but in the church in 2019, those who would eventually believe in him, us. And he prays for us that we would be one, as he and the Father are one, so that the world would believe that Jesus was sent from the Father. So get this, what Jesus is saying in this prayer as he prays for us is that our unity, our oneness, though we're distinct, we're one, and that when we exercise that oneness, when we demonstrate that unity, that spiritual oneness, the world will believe that he is sent from the Father. When we're divided and we're fighting and we're disagreeing, it undermines the very witness of the church. And that's why we at Manoa Community Church believe so strongly that our witness depends on our unity with the larger church. So if you're a church that believes in Jesus, believes in the gospel, believes in the Bible, preaches the gospel, seeks to make disciples, then we believe you are on our team and we are on your team. And that if you prosper, we prosper. And if you suffer, we suffer. We are on the same team. We collaborate with Christians across denominational lines to see our region saturated with the gospel. And that's why I'm so excited that this Saturday we have our second Haverford Worship United event happening at 68 Vineyard Church. It's in Haverford Township. It's at six o'clock. It's going to seven o'clock. Child care is going to be provided this time as well. And directions parking instructions, everything is available in the email that I'm sending this video attached with. If you're watching this on YouTube, or if you're watching this on Facebook, check out the comments. There'll be a link there to find all the details to this event. This Saturday at Vineyard 68 is in Haverford Township. Again, all the details there at six o'clock to seven o'clock. This is a great event with lots of churches from the township coming together to pray together, to worship together, to take communion together. It's a wonderful time just to express our unity and our oneness and pray that we would saturate this township and this region with the gospel together. So I pray you come out this Saturday to express this value of collaboration, to meet other Christians, to build relationships with them and to pray with them as Jesus has prayed for us in his high priestly prayer for unity and for oneness. Also, I'd love to see you this Sunday, 9.30 a.m. as we continue our Believe series. So join us for that. God bless you guys. Have a great week. Bye.